Well, Stevie, I was just saying to you off camera, you must be really disappointed after getting yourself so much back into that game to lose a late goal. Absolutely. I mean, it's uh, it's fine lines between success and failure. Uh, and we've told the players that we, we do really, really well to, from 3-1 down and have a period of play. We get the corner, we make it 3-2, and I thought we were really in the ascendancy then, you know, and we, we go forward, we manage to the equaliser. And at that time, we've just got to make sure that we're no naive. We've, we were actually trying to get Robertson off the pitch, right back, he was injured. Uh, and we were trying, but we, there was no stop and play to get him off. But we've got, as, players, as a group of players, we've got to deal with that. We've got to make sure he's covered on that side until we manage to get him off the pitch. And you know, yeah, Paddy Boyle runs 60 yards, gets in behind us, and, and, and scores a goal. So it's a, it's a hard one to take, particularly when you work so hard, been 3 1 down, show a bit of character to get yourself back at 3 each against a very, very good side. A very good side, as good on their side as I've seen in recent years. But uh, you know, obviously, losing the fourth goal and, and deservedly, air go, air go up the road with three points. Yes, it was uh, must must have been bad for you as well. The beginning of the second half, you'd looked like you were starting to dominate areas of the play there. At the end of the first half, and then suddenly out you come, and you've got a couple of goals. But against you, that must have disappointed you as well. It has. I mean, last week we lost. It. We were probably the dominant side in the first half against Wraith Rovers, and lost a goal three minutes before half time. And we've did the same today. I thought we were one 0 up today and, and looking really comfortable. Uh, apart from McDade hitting the post in the first half, we'd restricted there, and I thought we had taken the game to air in the first half, got the goal. But then we lose a goal you know, just before half time, and that, that changes what you're talking about at half time. And then we come out the, the, the second half, and you're absolutely right, we didn't start the second half, and suddenly we found ourselves 3 1 down. But you know, we showed character to come back, and then obviously the fourth goal was just the, the most disappointing thing in the aspect of the game. Well, Ian, uh, to say it was an exciting game, it's maybe not exactly what you want out of it. 4 3, it's three more points, but my goodness, we nearly chucked it away. Yes, but you know, you being fans, you know, we, all the fans shout for exciting football and we want to be excited, we want to be excited. Well, there you are, we won 4-3. Uh, as a manager, I wasn't happy about it. We, we a lot of good individual performances. I don't think we played that well. Uh, but the bottom line is we made three really poor individual errors for the three goals, albeit the third one, the boys are saying it was a blatant push. But they were put under a lot of pressure because at that point we should have been five or six one up. We just missed some absolute sitters and played the wrong pass at the wrong time and, and it really we should have been really, really comfortable and, and then we nearly threw it away but Paddy Boyle's come up with a that's a left back running fifty yards to get beyond somebody and uh, and finishing. So it's a great three points for us because it's not easy here, particularly in a horrible day like this with the wind the way it was. Yes, but we did have some really good performance. We thought Ross Doherty today uh, dominated a lot of the midfield play and seemed to be very much in form, but I'm seeing from your face you're going to have a different response to us. I just said to him, that's, that's the poorest he's been all season. Really, I thought he was well below his standard. So uh, we were dis he's disappointed in himself. He knows he can do far better. But, uh, you know, but listen, it's a team It's a team effort and uh, goals come from everywhere and, uh, and, and never better shown than today with Paddy's. Thanks very much. Cheers.